last night's dive was absolutely amazing. Uh, there was um, just anticipation of, of the event going off and there's a little bit of worry because we've heard of reports going off the night before, had we missed it, had we not. But very, very quickly, we actually started seeing coral spawn in the water. These tiny, tiny little mauvey pink balls slowly floating up. And then we're finding all these beautiful coral colonies just laden with these little parcels of sperm and egg. And just watching them for 20, 30 minutes, then all of a sudden they just erupt, kind of like a, a smokestack going up, but I've just I've made up of tiny pink balls drifting up to the, the surface. Coral spawning is actually the sexual reproduction of corals. Corals are an amazing little animal. They're actually a jellyfish style animal that for most of their life actually grow by asexual reproduction. That means they split in two and they split in four and so on. But once a year, a few nights after the full moon, they'll actually want to get genetic variability. So they actually create sperm and egg and they release that into the water column and hope that sperm and egg meets. The Great Barrier Reef itself is such a unique ecosystem. There are coral reefs all around the world, but there's none the magnitude and complexity as we have on the Great Barrier Reef. 